Hi, I'm Lutz Central from Berlin. Uh, the last time I talked to you, I was unemployed. So now I started working at Otis. It's an elevator company and it's a really fine job. Working here, designing elevators, escalators and moving walkways sounds like a natural fit for someone with Lutz's electrical engineering background. But getting to this point wasn't easy. Lutz graduated back in January and he sent out more than three dozen applications before landing a job. I am relieved just because I was unemployed such a long time that really dragged me down a little bit so this is my positive fact of the whole thing of working is that I am working. Throughout Europe, especially in countries that have been hit hard by the Euro crisis, nearly half of all young people are unemployed and looking at an uncertain future. The 27-year-old Lutz says he feels lucky that he found work so quickly compared to some of his European peers. I mean, that's, that's a terrible feeling if you're like, yeah, I'm freshly... Uh, examined from my, from my uh, school, yeah, or I have now a diploma or a master or something, but nobody needs me. Maybe with the last decisions in Europe that will get better. The European Central Bank recently outlined plans to ease the debt crisis and secure the future of the zone's shared economy. But some economists say the reforms are also making it even more difficult for young people to find work. If uh, I look around in Europe, that's the situation for other young people is not so good as mine. Over the weekend, thousands took to the streets of Madrid, Lisbon and Paris to protest the austerity measures. Matt Small, The Associated Press.